Hello and a very warm welcome back here to Eurovision 365. I am Boric, I'm your host, and you are always welcome here indeed. The Junior Eurovision final is only a few days away, and I, of course, have still a few reaction videos to make. So I thought it's about time I got that done. By the way, if you have been with me on the journey reacting to the songs, thanks so much for doing that, but also make sure to let me know your comments below your thoughts on the songs I'm reacting to, but also more generally speaking, the songs that are taking part at Junior Eurovision 2023 in Nice, France. As I say, it's only a few days away, so let's get going. The next song I'm going to be reacting to is a song representing Ukraine. And this time Ukraine is being represented by Anastasia Dimid. And uh, <laughs> the song is called Kvitka. Kvitka. Um, probably doesn't sound anything like that at all, does it? But anyway, I'll find out soon how it's pronounced. Uh, yeah, so Anastasia will be hoping to win for the second time for Ukraine. Like I said, they've won once before and uh, it's Anastasia's namesake. Will Anastasia bring home the gold for Ukraine for the second time? Well, there's only one way to find out, isn't there? Yeah, you know what's coming now, don't you? You know the drill. Let's press play! Yeah. So, I'm pressing play this very second now. Anastasia dressed very traditionally, it looks like. Yellow and blue of Ukraine colors. Like a lullaby can a lullaby can start there, isn't it? Kvitka. This means flower, apparently. Yes, a bit of an upbeat sound here coming through. A bit of a dance number. Okay, turn it into English here. The back end dancers are wearing the same kind of Ukraine colors, the yellow and the blue. Matching Anastasia. It's very catchy, this chorus. Time flies so fast, tell me about it. <laughs> it really does. See, I'm kind of singing along to that already, and this is genuine first time listening, as you know. Oh, yes. Oh, I love that. Love that part there. Stop this tragedy. It's an interesting song. It's, it seems to be a fairly serious subject that uh, Anastasia is singing about. It kind of has a happiness to it as well. The contrasty. I suppose that's the whole point of a junior contest. The fun, the joy. There we go, that is it. That is Anastasia Kvika, Kvika. Flower, flower, that uh, is translated into English for me anyway, here on YouTube. And uh, yeah, that's not a bad song at all for Ukraine. Ukraine placed ninth last year. They would be hoping to do much better this year. And uh, I would be interested to see how that does on the bigger stage. Anastasia looks like she has a lot of confidence, so she does. 
I um, I like the melody. I love the way it goes into sort of traditional ethnic part with her vocals towards the end of the song. It's like a bridge then to the ending of the song towards the end of the chorus. And uh, yeah, I, I, I do quite like that. Uh, what I like, I suppose, most about it is the melody, how catchy that is. Because I was singing along to that, uh, badly, but I was singing along to that. And um, that's always a good sign. That, like a good hook, a strong hook is very important when it comes to a competition where you have like three minutes, just under three minutes to make an impact. Uh, but yeah, that's Ukraine. And like I say, the final of junior year vision is only a few days away from now as i record this but uh, until then you know what's time for yes it is time for podrick's rating so my rating out of 10 based on this very first lesson is seven out of ten congratulations to anastasia congratulations to ukraine i wish anastasia the very best of luck and anastasia if you're ever watching this you are a hero just like the other young people taking part at this contest. So that's what I think, but what do you think? Do you love it? Do you think it's gonna win? What's your favorite song? You know what to do, let me know in these comments below. I love reading them. So please do let me know and share your thoughts and opinions. So I hope you enjoyed that. As I said, there's only a few more to do when it comes to these reactions. So I do hope you can join me again in the next video. But until then, you take care. I'll see you very soon.